To the hardwood again for the high school basketball playoffs. The boys are just getting underway in the by district round while the girls have reached the regional quarterfinals. Three teams are still alive on that side in College Station, Hearn, and Normagee. Guess what? We have highlights of all three. That's how KX Sports does it. That's why you want to stick with us. Let's start with the C-Stack Cougars taking on Pflugerville Weiss out in Rockdale. First possession of the game. The one to watch is Reese Vilvaldi. Nice pass to a cutting Jaden McMillan. She's going to put it up and in. Great start for the Lady Cougars. And it would continue. Moments later, coach is like, let's keep this thing going. Taylor Montgomery spinning, winning, turn around, jumper, nothing but the bottom of the net. College Station up 14 to 10. Then Puff Collins running the show. Drive, no look dish to Jaden Davenport. Crowds it, puts it up and in. Cougars now up 22 to 13. It's all good. Collins says, let me try to shoot one this time. Nope, not there, but McMillan rebound, puts it up and in, plus the harm and the foul. What a night for number 32, and what a night for C-Stat. Montgomery, step back three, bang, give it to her. College Station headed to the regional tournament with a 63-40 to victory. Class 2A now, Hearn, one win from a regional tournament. Berth taking on Weimer tonight. Close game in the first half. Cross-court pass, Ania Jackson to Michaela Dunn. Yes, man, from the three-point corner pocket. Love to see it. Lady Eagles up by one at the break. Third quarter now, Hearn turn up the pressure. Wide open, CR Golden. Her shot is all golden. How about that? A six-point lead now for the Lady Eagles. Everything, let's cook in for Hearn. First shot, no good here by Antonisia Jackson. Is there for the putback. How about 23 doing work down low? Fourth quarter now. Turn up the pressure. Jackson says, give me those cookies. Ahead to Jada Johnson. Lays it up and in. Say it isn't so. Lady Eagles win it. 49-37. They're headed to the regional tournament for the first time in school history. How about that story? Norma G also looking to get to that regional tournament. Lady Panthers taking on Shiner tonight. Norma G, the press is on. Stealing it. Looking good. Put it up and in by Christina Witherspoon. Well, that puts Norma G on the board really quick, thanks to nice defense. Later in the first, Witherspoon kicking it out. Morgan Hemphill, yes, ma'am, nothing but the bottom of the net. Lady Panthers retake the lead. Shiner, though, able to keep it close. Check out Callie Savechik in the paint. Oh, gets the roll off the backboard. Norma G, though, still up by one. This was a close one. Then Briley Smith. Gonna flip it up and put it up and in. Norma G, they let it by three after one and they hang on to win it. We're all winners across the board in the Brazos Valley 54 to 40. Let's end with some boys action now. Franklin taking on Caldwell over at Bryan High School. Caldwell comes out swinging off the turnover. Jamar Hewitt to Delvin Morris. He'll lay it up and in on the fast break. So Caldwell looking good. But then here come the Lions. Devin Hildrago in the paint here. Probably gets harmed and the foul, but anyways, puts it up and in off the backboard. Five did some scoring. He can also pass Hildrago from Hayden Helton here. Going to dish it off to Malcolm Murphy. Backdoor cut alert. Lays it up and in. Lions are coming in hot. Now, Helton, you saw him do some work passing the ball this time down low off the Marcus Wade miss. Helton rebound. Strong man bucket. Franklin goes on to win it. 55. 250. For all tonight's scores, you know where to go. The sports page. We'll be right back.